And before we move on to anything else, I'm gonna, you know, equip those things. One of them, at least. Fan Razor is interesting enough, but I like something with a little more meat to it. Let's see, a combo attack that weakens your god arc's nature. Attack power is increasing its arc, going weak to your attack's attributes. Okay, that's interesting. Uh, Gusty Edge, and activates your god arc to perform a stronger advancing chain attack. Huh. I'll definitely switch to that mainly, unless there's something else here. Plant your feet and spin your scythe and shred through Argami. Press square or button to for a continuous attack. Ooh! Uh, maybe not. Execution or jump, 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 wait, jump high and swing down on a lethal strike. Plugs increase damage against down Aragami. Alright. Yeah, that's... Okay. Power, activate your guard, perform a chain attack with increase of, of the absorption. Now attack with greatly increased damage against Aragami weak points. We don't have that. A mad orbit, there you go, combat attack during my residence. A star assault attack with your scythe in its extended form, but I mean safe, not even those on the ground. The windmill drop an aerial somersault carries you forward into a rapid drop. Restore stamina on hit. That could be helpful for what we have. Resonance wave activates your gun, increasing the power of every attack. And that's about it. So either this or the uh what was it? The shearing scar, no, not that. I think it no, it wasn't sword of power. It's the one that uh where is it? Pendulum, and that's interesting. Well, the wind will now the wind will drop because you, again, you guys know us. Using a scythe gets him very, very tired, very, very quickly. So I'll have to experiment with that in my free time, whenever that may be. Oh, speaking also before I forget, we're maxed out full inventory. We're not able to, you know, use whatever they have. So I'd like to get rid of something. Let's see, maybe cure radial. Kill punch, radial, putting their shield. I'll get rid of. Uh, yeah, let's see what let's, let's, let's see. Okay, so that so that's the radial one. That can be very helpful. Uh, the shield. It's not even a shield. Yeah. Nope. Unequip, there we go. Alright, now we have one spot for when we absorb weapons. I don't know, that's kind of a weird thing, though. If you have to have at least one open slot for that, why not just make that a guaranteed thing? You know, it seems like some kind of incentive. I don't know, either way. So they're paying the walls of the satellite base? Now's our chance to shine! What, did you hear? Go talk to Julius, he's in the branch director's office. Okay, then. Uh, that'd be this section, right? That is Sakaki, give my plan his official approval. Sasuke will be in charge of moving the patients. First, we've been tasked to keep Aragami away from the base while his walls are being repaired. Plays well, a series of battles over the duration. She has the details. She can fill you in. Geo? We're going to repair the satellite base's walls. We're going to lure Aragami away and destroy them. Find us three, three bases. That means three missions. This is new for us. I'll explain. Consecutive battles? This one operation comes of three missions. Each mission is the same scale as the typical one. Between so each mission we can rest, but there is no resupply, and we'll proceed directly to the next. Not even need a regular bias factor intake, but we've obtained a portable type of extended duty. Any words of caution? You will not evacuate any fires who received multiple grievous wounds and are deemed unable to continue. With no reserve fires, choose carefully who to bring. Same goes for god arcs and consumables. No more questions then. There should be no powerful enemies, but the fight will be long, and you must prepare carefully. Okay, then this is gonna be very interesting. This will be very, very interesting. So let's go restock some supplies while we're at it. Let's see here, restore pills. There we go. Got those, got that. Why not? So we have a bunch of those. Holy water, and a small statue. And it's, it's interesting stuff. Stun grenades. Never know. Store fill S's. Wait, what? Uh, I'm gonna 
assume those were, uh, the North main thing. Yeah, the sword. No. Okay, they're putting our main thing. Just, just, just making sure. Just making sure. Okay. So that's taken care of. I don't know what you have to say about this, if I can talk to you. A series of battles, huh? I haven't per perfected freeze-drying my own sandwiches yet. I could bring some dry-powered oat mix, but it's just not the same. Uh, guess we'll have to think of something else. A series of battles, huh? Between the guard or you're comfortable with. What do you call a loyal and reliable partner? Gotcha. I guess while we're at it, we might as well... Let's see. What else do we have? Healing beam we can be able to use heal lasers. Laser! I guess in general I should probably give them the ability to use healing shots. Each of them. Bind hits. The attacks and chances cause the bind. Wait, the bind effect on the enemy. So like that, let's have make sure that's a guarantee as well. Guessing this is just a bare chance. Wait, what? I hit two more of this. Yeah. That's right, I forgot you had to uh, use gap as well. I can't believe in my mind. A little, a little confused there. Fine hits, definitely. Wrath of Revenge, Dexterous, I'm Effect. Does he have, also have that, uh, thing? Oh, I saw it, I saw it. Find it. I'll get this done. My way. Alright. Absorption. Mm. I guess it's a given, but, you know. Not the revenge. The inner force of the teammate is incapacitated. That tends to happen to me a lot, so that might be a lot uh, better to have than me, I uh, think. Maybe we can change their uh, blood arts. Or maybe not. Never mind. Never mind. Out of revenge, and we'll pull it. Rapid fire, normal. Yeah, that's a lot of stuff. Group Frank Deal. Group's ability to keep things stable in the melee brawl. Sure. So that's his thing. I, I thought it was down below, but apparently not. Ah, man, this is all boring. Dexterous. Dexterous. Hey, those mute do makes it hard to be spot by our game. No. Eh, don't really care about that much. It's interesting, but not necessary. It's my strength when facing two more Arakami. Mine hits, definitely. Still a growing girl after all. And I guess HP up. Still a growing girl after all. Alright. You can all do the others later. Again, customizing a team, a whole team specifically, it's a little boring, especially when I haven't done much of that to begin with. It's an aspect of the game that's important, but not important enough for me to uh, put too much time into it. Alright. Let's go into the missions, then. I've seen a new mission for Blood. Standard mission. Ooh, and now we're in difficulty four. This mission is a survival mission consisting of multiple parts. Zulu items are not restored during survival missions, but blood arts and equipment sets can be changed. Heroes who reach zero endurance on a mission will be removed and unable to survive until all missions are completed. Okay. In addition, no snack items may be brought into survival missions, so you want so watch which supplies you carry. Snack supplies. Does that count as pills? Nope, not. But alright, we got ourselves the big one. Termite repellent. In preparation for a major repair operation on the satellite base's anti-origami wall, our origami must be lured away from the base and destroyed. This operation will consist of three phases. During the first phase, a number of cocoon maids and zygos must be dispatched. And a non-divine weapon is recommended. Alright then, pretty straightforward. Julius is fixed, no matter what. That being said, by having your reliable allies, you can bring in Gilbert for this. 
And then... Chill. I guess chill. Yeah, freezing. We got armor. We should be good. Uh, I guess we'll have... Actually, we should take it there care of that in a sec. That's all taken care of. Blah, blah, blah. Okay, can I change the uh, thing on the other... Uh, the four characters? Personal abilities. I can. I might as well do that. At least for, uh... I forgot, I forgot her name. Not Lika. Hibari. Okay, here we go. Let's see. Ignore time. Bond break reward up. I'll get the ignore time, that's for sure. I truly hope I can keep everyone safe. Alright, so there's one. Let's see. There was the awake chance. Sword skill allows blood our chance of awakening to grow faster. That's also very uh, essential. Nothing like learning a new skill. And that's about it, unless there's something else I can purchase, which does not look like there is the case. Nope. Okay. I guess that'll do then. Here's to the long, drawn out battle that goes on for uh, who knows how long. Fingers crossed. Is everyone ready to return? Alright, T. Yeah, and in 3 minutes, 10 seconds or less. Not bad. Although, I got a feeling things are just gonna get slightly harder. It makes sense in a way, survival kind of thing. Board rate up, VA chance of a wake up, team AP up, or consumable items up. I go for this. Don't worry, it's part of the job. Defense. 
Ooh, attack position, which gets two different effects. And then the HP vision, like usual. And yeah, triple S. Looks like our endurance is a okay. As for blood, not that much, huh? Yeah, I probably should have figured. So we got a bunch of them already. Nope. Check ally endurance. Okay. This base camp we can prepare for your next mission. Huh. You check our endurance right here. Alright, fine. Check your equipment set. Okay, so I can definitely change... Oh, what? Wait, choose equipment set. Huh. Okay, so you're gonna have multiple of these things instead of just, you know, changing the same one. That's... Definitely something I need to work on when I'm done here. That would be heavenly to have. Uh, link supports. Yeah, these are still fine as they are. I can return to the tile at any point, but I'm not gonna do that for, by, for obvious reasons. I need to save and all that. I think we're good. Next mission, the Wailing Plains. Phase 2, only one shield for each weaponry is what recommended. Good thing we got a scythe that can get that in 5 minutes. And even then, we got our gun that can also do that. A bunch of stuff here. Probabilities are very low for a lot of them. Again. Oh, you just go to ready. There we go. I wonder how many of these kind of missions we'll have, uh, you know, now that we've unlocked this kind of thing.